Today, we are customizing NBA jerseys. We're gonna have two hours to make a custom jersey and then our judge will decide who has the best jersey. I'm gonna be making a Philadelphia 76ers jersey. I am customizing the Los Angeles Lakers jersey. I'm gonna be doing the Brooklyn Nets. Everyone here also has $50 to go out to an art store and buy more supplies that they feel like they don't got enough stuff here. So with that being said, the time starts now. Boys, what is your favorite NBA jersey of all time? My favorite NBA jersey probably has to be the Lakers, the Hollywood black jersey. Phoenix Suns. Which one? The one that says the Valley. Oh, the, the Suns Valley jersey, your favorite yeah. ever? Yeah. That's a good one, that's a good one. I think my favorite jersey of all time, dude, the Heat's 90s red throwback jersey is fire. What do you guys think the worst jersey of all time was? Easy, Dallas Mavericks jersey. Oh. So I was gonna say Dallas Mavericks too, but not their current jerseys. In the 2000s, the Mavericks had a jersey that looked like a trash bag. I'm so scared of messing this up, dude. Which team do you guys think consistently has the best jerseys? The Lakers, baby. Really? Well, I think the Lakers are very consistent. I would have to say the Heat. Yeah, I think the Heat. I would take the Heat's design team over the Lakers any day. I, yeah, I think the Nike Heat logo. Sam, you're going with the Nike logo on yours, not the Jumpman? Uh, no. What do you think's cooler, the Jumpman or the swoosh? They're yeah. both pretty cool. I personally like the, the swoosh better. Yeah. Oh, I can't get this thing open. <laughs> Yeah, can you be a real man for me? Be a real man, dude. Thank you, thank you. John, can you help us out? Wow, Jeff, you're so strong. Yo, I feel like Bob Ross. You look like him too. This is your world. When do you think Bob Ross decided like that was what he was gonna do with his life? I feel like he came out the womb and just like started doing paint. Bro, I'm just gonna say it right now, boys. The concept I came up with for this team is fire. And they're actually gonna make this their official jersey next season. Really? They're gonna hire you? They might. It's not a Nike check mark. Oh no, Jeff, what is that? James had a one line that seems to always go in my favor somehow. He looked at me and said, oh, John's looking really good. I'm not really worried about Jeff. Can't lie, John actually has a very good start to his. Not so intimidated by Jeff though. There's no way the jersey you make is gonna be better than mine. We got trash talk going on. Yeah, and there's no way the jersey you make is gonna be better than mine either, Jeff. This is a competition. Bro, here's the thing about being Asian. Tell me what it's like. With the brush? Feels like you're doing calligraphy. No, I was gonna say you have great calligraphy. It's yeah. racist. You're gonna call me a racist against another another Asian? Mm-hmm. Is this a mirror? These are the worst brushes I've ever used. Well, it's these are the old brushes from shoe painting, so. Oh, Kevin, do I show them the, the heat that I'm about to unleash on them, or do I refrain a little bit? I'll refrain. I'll refrain. Gotta tease. I'll just keep working on the, the edges. You're that type of people. John, are you talking trash? John's trash talk is the nicest trash talk I've ever heard. You know what? I'm going with the style of, like, this is looking bad because it's artistically bad. You see the blotches? Doesn't that look good? Right? Kevin, talk to me. Okay, thank you. Kevin. I would have punched you, Kevin. He would have beat me up. Oh, if you mess with cameraman Kevin, you go to the gulag. Kevin was in the military. Yeah, Kevin literally was in the military. He had no shot. Kevin would one beat us <laughs> backwards while somersaulting. <laughs> You're in the Lakers, right, Jeff? You know they don't play in uh, Hollywood, right? Why you wear Hollywood on it? Hollywood. When I saw Jeff was doing the Lakers, the way he disrespected them with his gold paint, very disappointed. I actually wanted to do the Lakers, but Jeff snagged them first. So for my 76ers jersey, I wanted to use a darker blue and a darker red to make it a little bit more, you know, patriotic, more like the Team USA jersey, since the Sixers are meant to be a patriotic team. I put the 13 stars around the Sixers because the 13 colonies, they signed the Declaration of Independence in 76. So wanted to connect it, keep the team identity flowing. One of the design choices that I went, I know it's more on the black, gray but you know what i wanted to give it a little bit of more pop so i added red and it's gonna be sponsored by make a wish so you know the judge can feel a little on my side bro talk to me nice red what nets jersey has red the youth the youth Dude, i got mine so dirty god dang it no dude my pen is making these ugly blotches Bro, too. Good thing it, Kevin. Kevin didn't say shit, bro. Don't give him credit. Kevin can talk telepathically too. Oh, that's right. Kevin just said you have a small pee pee. That's not nice, Kevin. Oh, wait. Incoming message from Kevin. Oh, John's jersey looks like shit. <laughs> Kevin, look what you started. All right, boys. I'm going to Michael's. Oh, Jeff, you're going out to get the supplies? Yeah. I'm going to be the one making the move. Hopefully, you can find something. You guys want me to get you guys anything? Yeah. Too bad. As I was customizing, I really didn't know what to do with just the paint and the markers. So I had to go use a $50 budget to go to Michael's. I made it to Michael's. My goal here is to get things that I can just add on to make it look cool. My real question is, 
should I help out John? Maybe I should, you know? I feel kind of bad. Dude, I feel like low-key, Jeff should have, if he was gonna go to Michael's, he should have done it earlier in the process, because now I feel like he's just losing time. He, doesn't even, he probably doesn't even know what he's getting. John, can you explain to me why you chose two different shades of red? You know, because this jersey is sponsored by Make-A-Wish. So it's bad? So you want to give the kids bad coloration or what? Yeah, it's a representation of the people. We all come in different shades. Wow, that was something. This thing is just eating paint, just consuming all the paint. Look at Jeff's jersey, bro. This is insulting. You getting intimidated, John? Huh? Intimidated? Oh, dude, I am n not one bit. I'm paying attention to my art. Okay. Pay attention to yours. Okay. Yo, y'all are going crazy. You guys are actually going insane. Yeah. Let's go. Get the sponsor and everything. So Jeff has been gone for quite a while now. What do you think he's up to? Oh, you're not gonna talk to me? Oh. What's up, brother? Oh, yeah. I feel like he's just aimlessly going on every I feel aisle. Like Jeff's now. not gonna make any more changes to that jersey. Similar to how I didn't know what I was gonna draw on the jerseys, when I walked into Michael's, I had no idea. I literally went down every single aisle, started grabbing things that were gold. That this is really gonna bring everything I have together. I'm excited to go back. Only thing is, because I went to Michael's, I don't have much time to put this together. So I kind of have to rush back. I had a great idea for a Lakers jersey, and Jeff took the Lakers, so I'm a little salty that he's kind of wasting the opportunity I feel like low-key. Which one are you doing? The Nets. That's a Nets jersey? Leave me alone. Sorry, I'm being mean. I should be nice to you. You actually decided to stay and hang out with me. I'm like Jeff. <laughs> you think Jeff doesn't like us? He always brings on this challenge. Should we help each other out? And give each other like some suggestion. pointers. Yeah, you want to do some constructive criticism of each other? What do you oh, think I, I should fix? Since you did a drop shadow on this, yeah. you should do a drop shadow on that. Think about it. Okay. Do you, do you know why the Sixers are called the Sixers? No way. Dude, go back to Italy. All right, John, give us a freestyle. I be coloring shirts and I fly up like a bird. Fly so high, call me Larry Bird. Wow. I'm not Jamaican, but put me on a Rasta. I'm about to draw this Nike logo. I look at Jeff's jersey and I know the Lakers would say that's a no-go. Ooh. Ooh. I look over at John's jersey. I don't go there, bro. And I say, why is it red? <laughs> that's like the New Jersey Nets. But that shit is dead. <laughs> it's from the Sixers, but all I can think about is the Catalano wine mixer. What? Not your best effort there, bro. I feel like low key, yours could have been good, John. The problem with, in my opinion, of yours. Now, having said this, you might win the video, so all this trash talking, it might be for nothing. I feel like the problem with yours is that your design is cool, it's just the colors, you're kind of losing the team identity a little bit. We live in a world where identity is fluid, so. Dead. No championship having ass team. Oh, Jeff just texted us. Let's see what Jeff said. How much time do we have? My total was $50.27. Right on the dot. Heading back to the house. I literally have only 30 minutes. It's gonna take me 15 minutes to drive there. So I really gotta rush. I'm gonna make a perfect Nike logo and make Jeff's jersey look even worse. And that's how you do a perfect Nike logo. Oh, wow. Who should the sponsor be for the Sixers? I mean, if you're going to the Patriotic, you should put a gun. Bro, I think I'm done. Yeah, I'm about to be done too. Why do I feel like Jeff is gonna cheese it? He's taking his sweet time. Jeff was in last place, and then he decided not to make any progress for an hour. Dude, Jeff probably bought a new whole yeah. penny. I'm probably gonna take mine out to dry. All right. Yeah! Yeah! So I had a big conundrum. I tried to draw a star on the shoulders. My original idea was to have the stars on the shoulder like the American flag. The star needs help. <laughs> Bro, at least I'm using the colors of the team that I'm working on. So I had to scrap that design. It made me a little nervous. That was what I was most hyped for when I made my jerseys. But I think my jersey turned out really good. The competition right now is looking very tough. Well, more against James. I'm not sure about Jeff, but I feel like Jeff has a trick up his sleeve. What did you buy? I bought a lot of stuff. I got this chain, so I'm gonna put this chain on here. I'm gonna put this mirror on somewhere. You know, it's Hollywood, so like in case like on the course on that, like you wanna take a look at yourself real quick? You know? Hopefully this goes well. But how are you gonna do this with me and John just watching your every move? This is very uh, intimidating, a lot of pressure. Towards the end, when I came back and I knew that John and James were done, I was completely shook. I was worried. I only had 15 minutes left and they were just staring at me. So the pressure was on. Now, Jeff, can you tell us what the design choice with the, this was? What is this? So much like, you know how you turn your jersey around and it got dirty? I moved my phone and it pulled the whole thing. So this mm. got onto here. So I had to add like...
Wait. You want to take a look at our jerseys yeah, real quick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah let's just waste Oh, John! 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 What are you doing? I need, I, need, I need all my time. Now, how are we gonna put the chain on? Um, I'm gonna poke some holes and just like twist tie them. I don't want to spend too much time on one yeah, thing. Six, yeah, I don't. I don't like when it's like a choker. Tight, yeah. yeah. A little too kinky for me. Come on! Well, Jeff, you're the whole center of attention <laughs> so, right now, bro. I don't you're... like it. This is so much pressure. I'm getting this uh, knife. Do not do this at home, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never seen a jersey that comes with a chain on it. Yeah. You don't think that'd be hard to play basketball in? This like, every like... time you jump, that chain's gonna hit you in the chin. The Lakers wouldn't be caught dead wearing it on the court, would they? They could. They could. They, w they shouldn't. <laughs> what is that? Is that glue? Is that like heavy duty glue? I've never what? seen that before. <laughs> what is that? Why are you shaking? Yeah, why are you shaking? Are you nervous? Yes, I am. Wow, why you got so many notifications? Why are you so popular? I'm not popular. Everyone's texting you and everyone who's in the room is looking at you. You must be pretty popular. No, I think this is a strategy. I think you've hit up everybody to text me right now. So that look, that's looking <laughs> solid. Like, it's, it's, it's... You don't think it's dangerous for there to be glass on a jersey? You know, the biggest thing about selling a product is telling a story. When I got these... <laughs> when, 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 when I got these bells, I was like... You know what? It's gonna be attached, but as when you wear the jersey, you just toss it because you're like, my money don't jiggle, jiggle, right? Like you don't have jiggling money. You see that? Oh my God, that actually fits well. Oh, what if, what if I add glue on it? Take your time, Jeff. You have ten minutes. All right, this might be the stupidest thing I do. How's it gonna stick? <laughs> all right, all right. Jeff, that's gonna make a mess. Why are you just pouring glitter on it? I think I'm done. All right, let's put our jerseys on and see who the winner is. Today we customize jerseys for NBA teams. You're gonna guess what team the jersey is from and then the person who customized it's gonna do a little explanation of it and you're gonna choose who the winner is today. 100% sure this is Lakers number eight, Hollywood. Lakers, right? Correct. Bro, this is fire, bro. I have never seen clothes with a beard on. So <laughs> that way when I'm looking at Jeff, I can be looking at myself. Yes. White and gold, it's sparkling. There's a, it comes with a chain? Yeah. That's gas. So basically, usually a sponsorship goes right here, but you know, you could be the sponsor. I don't like is this star looks a little demented. And I don't know what these are for. It looks like you just like wiped off the paintbrush. But overall, I like it. All right, I'm up next. What team do you think this is? Raptors, I don't know. Very clean and simple Sixers jersey. 13 stars for the 13 colonies when the 76ers signed the Declaration of Independence. You know, when you're going into a competition like this, it sucks when you don't fully get the paint in there you know there's white going on a lot of little random paint marks but you know the sixers text it's nice bold aggressive numbers very clean the tesla logo it's a great touch what team do you think this is i think that says brooklyn yes yes the brooklyn nets so you know everybody got their a little sponsorship, but this jersey is only specifically used for charity purposes. You know, well, it is a shame for it to be charity. They're having some of the worst line work I've seen on any of them. So as you can tell, the, the logo on my jersey is a little bit too intricate. So like the outline is not as fine as I really wanted it to be. But I feel like with the resources that I had, it's going to get the dub. I, got, I gotta go with this one, number one. The mirror and the chain are just different. Dude, bro. what did I know? Okay. <laughs> and now you have to be kidding. Dude, what did I what? I'm gonna go with the Sixers, number two. Let's go. It was very tough to decide, honestly. Thank you guys for watching this video. We will see you on the next one. Peace.